Maybe somebody won't beat me up. I'm a really nice person, guys. I'm trying to follow your customs and everything, and you're threatening to kill me. I don't want to be killed. I still got an assassin to find. All right, what we got here? Trasman, Trasman. Um, three. Tuskeller. Keepers, compasses, Skeller. Try to. Twin, twice arrow split. Crows? Oh, I don't know you. Next time I think I'll play an Orlon. They seem cool. The Stone Bramble. The Fisher Crane. Oh, these must represent those folks. The, the, the sticks. The elders. Alright. Hello? Hello? Wait. I don't know if I should go through with this. Make the trade deal with the Anamain fast. Why? What's wrong? If a Valian deal with the Glanfad and weakens the Deerwood, it could mean war for the Republics in the future. What other option do you have? I could put the idea in the Anamanfath's head that the Republics are not interested in exclusive trade, but limited trade of goods that they do not already trade with the Dear Woodens. Mm. Limited trade of goods that they already not trade. So, she doesn't want to go through with the exclusive deal. It's the right thing to do. The Deerwoodians are at the mercy of the Republics, and they don't even know it. Your actions can prefer further suffering. Follow your heart. You alone must be done. That's a terrible idea. Um, do what you want to Pelagina. This is your deal. I helped you get here. But do what you need to do. Pelagina nods her head resolutely. Okay, I hope we just didn't fuck up. Um, I hope we didn't just fuck up. Uh, Gwanfath, Gwanfath. Hey. Hi. Ooh, who are you? I don't know who you are. Another Estramore. What do you want? Um. You sound like Lady Webb. I'm looking for another who passed through the city. Few Estramoran are given the freedom of our sacred city. That you ask for this person is suspicious. There are reasons we don't let you Estramoran roam our sacred city. Reasons I am coming to understand. Uh, has something happened here recently? She says, more than I care to think about. Looters have grown bolder at the sites of the builders. The people of Defiance Bay set fire to their own city. And every week, the three Tusk Stelgar bring news of more desperate settlers pushing at our borders, trying to escape their plague of an old fame children. Ah, that means hollowborn to you guys. Suddenly, you feel the presence of someone else in the hall. The Amethyst continues to glare at you, but there's some something has stepped out of her skin and it reaches out Permitting towards you. more strangers, the freedom of the city is out of the question right now. Go and be thankful that Anamfath Shimak doesn't sit in the passage of the six today. He would not be so kind as I. Theos? Theos, are you in her? Are you in her? What the fuck am I watching? Farewell. A vision of an Orlon appears near Bethel. He is, has the same green brown fur and Hazel's eyes as she does. Help me reason with them. He points behind you. Turning, you see the ghostly shapes of five other Amanfatha. Another Orlon with tawny fur and a scarred face. A frowning dwarf, a black furred Orlon, and two elves. You're angry about something. I hear it in your voice. What is it? Bethwell says, Are the outrages I listed for you not enough? Trouble brews, and none of it is my choosing. The spectral Orlon takes another step from her, setting his foot down with a slow, heavy motion. Tendrils of essence stream between them, and he grimaces, leans forward as he's struggling against the gale. The angry Amanfeth winces. War. The spectral Orlon's voice is a rasping croak. They're headed for war. Remind them of Fairwilt's warning. 
Does Fairwood's warning mean anything to you? Bethel, Amatha Bethel? Fairwood's image gasps. Taunt threads of essence tug at him, drawing him back into the Ament Feth. He looks up at you again. I tried to warn them. The builder's souls have touched even the Estramorn. You'd better explain yourself. The builder's souls have touched even the Estramorn. There's no way you could have known this saying. Not unless you are a Galus on Anums, a watcher of souls. Feral tried to warn me, warn the other tribes about something. What is it? Feralt's warning came before the Broken Stone War. Feralt, my ancestor on my mother's side, was Anamfoth of our tribe then. When the Estramoric farmers defiled the Builder's monuments, Feralt urged the other Anamfotha to patience. But louder, angrier voices prevailed. Feralt believed that the invaders could be taught to respect the Builders as we do. He also believed the Builders' souls had spread to all peoples, and that we should avoid needless conflict with others. More practically, he worried that a violent response would only spur further bloodshed across the generations, and you can see where we are today. After two wars with the Deerwood, his warning's more relevant than ever. While Feralt's words were shrewd, they were ignored back then. Simply remembering his warning now will not undo the wars and the changes that the years have seen. There is blood on these stones, and that is all anyone remembers now. An image of a polished Adra cube flashes in your mind. There is writing on the side. The images are too faint for you to read. The Amman Fath turns away from you and looks at the ground, gnawing a gnawing a pointed claw. You can't change the past, but your choices still matter. Bethwell says, looks at you sadly. Yes, that is the problem. Another Estramor came through here a few days ago, and well, letting him through was a mistake. One I am eager not to repeat. The Guided Compass tribe has a reputation for being too soft with Estramorin. One that will not be improved by my failure to stop this man who has desecrated our most sacred sites. That sounds like the man I came here to stop. I won't repeat a mistake in my haste to correct it. We bar twin elms from Estramorin to protect the ancient places that the Builders left behind. The Builders left this heritage to us to defend, but they alone had access to it. On this much, at least the six tribes agree. You see the Polis Adra cornerstone in your mind. This time the image is clearer. Each trace of the stone is inscribed with a, face you know by, a phrase you know by heart. You feel your lips form words. A gift from the builders of civilization to the guardians of their legacy. May the guardians watch the door while the builders keep the key. These were the words given to the keepers of the stone. I know. Very well. The city is yours to explore. Tell the guard at the gate that you come to see the cornerstone with the blessing of the guided compass. If the gods have truly returned one of the builders to us, find the Delamgon of Ter Evron in Elm's Reach. If the gods have sent you here with a purpose, the Delamgon will know. All right. In the meantime, I shall be here to assist you. Um, one of my companions, a representative of the Vietnamese Republics, wishes to discuss a trade issue with you. Uh, sh the Orlon turns her gaze towards Pelagina. Yes, the Velilian godlike, blessed of Helia. Um, Pelagina bristles and spits out a crisp, sp spits out the response. So they say. And a diplomat of the Duke's Bells. I understand that you were to be sent with trade assurances from your masters. 
Pelagina says, Revi I can't even do her voice. Fereed Amantfath, it is true that I chosen to convey these assurances, but understand that I was fashioned more for war than etiquette. The Orlon smirks slightly. In these dangerous times, profess if it is better to send warriors to do diplomats' work. Pelagina musters a weak smile. Indeed. Amantfath, regarding the exclusive trade agreement... Nod your head, smile warmly. The Republic's view it would be the best long-term interest of all parties if you maintained your traditional good to trade with Deerwood. A strange turn. What do the Republics want, then, says Bethel. Um, Ty Ondra Taylor Pearls. Trade will be picking up quickly on them in the Eastern Reach. You will buy them exclusively from us for the next five years. In exchange, we will be your exclusive market for Adra Ban and Karo Golan for the same period. An interesting proposition, Vilayan. We will send emissaries to discuss the details at greater length. Your appearance here speaks well of your duke's intentions. Revered Amanthath. That's it. My position in the Brotherhood gone. I can't believe I just made up new trade terms to the Glanfather and Anamendva. Felagina... Pelagina, you did the right thing for the Republics, even if the Dukes can't see it from their vantage. You can deal with their disapproval later. Verus. They have a saying in Biagepe. New gold clears even the oldest debts. If I'm right, all will be forgiven. If not, there's nothing I can do about it now. Hey, if you're rejected from the Brotherhood, you and me can hang for life. You, can, you got a place in my keep, you can stay in my keep as long as you want. There's plenty of room there. Um, all right, so, oh, I leveled. Woot! I have a kitty. Kitty, 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 kitty. All right, let's see. What's this? Um, oh, a sign. Oh, minor items, two turns. Uh, Durance, go get, go get shit. All right, let's uh, level me up. Some levelness, some juicy levelness. Oh, 15, shit. Um, what my, what's my wheelhouse? My wheelhouse is athletics, and oh, oh wow. So what do what do I fucking get if I? Oh wait wait, what do I get if I increase my survival? Um, at six bonus damage against versus flank. Oh, okay, we can do that. Um, level six bonus access. Do I get anything from these guys? I got a lot of fucking endurance. Alright. Or should I just put all my eggs in one basket? No, I'll be okay. I'll be alright. Um, brilliant Radiance. Or Indiction. Uh, condemns dazing any... Ooh, I will take that. Don't even have to read anything else. Sweet Kana! Kana, do you get any more awesome stuff? More mechanics. <laughs> Alright, what we got here? Um, calls with Drake. I, I like that. I like that. Is it a great Drake? Um, summons two ogres for the duration. Ooh, ogres. Revives all allies with a... Sm oh, this is nice. Like, in, in case there's like a party wipe, I can put that through. Five phrases needed. Um, attacks enemies in seven directions around the Chanter with Bolts of Ice. Uh, empowers, okay, just, a, that's a buff and that's a buff. I like this. I like Raze again. Let's do this. Um, oh, and I have one more thing. Um, oh, utility, defense, unstoppable, um, uh, I like I, I, I like uh, that. What's offensive? Um, wild Hunter against Wilder against Interrupt and Blaze Slaughter. I think we're going to go defensive and we're going to go with the higher deflection bonus because he's like far away most of the time anyways. Alright, done. <laughs> Kiana, you are, you are looking to be a beast, y'all. Um, where is your gun? That's what was missing last time. That's not what I wanted. 
I want the gun. Where's my gun? Did I sell my gun? Um... Where's my shit? Does Doran's ha Oh, what the- I thought I equipped all this shit. Alright, let's put this back. Well, I don't have a gun for you right now. I think it's Endurance's possession. Which kind of sucks. So, you know what? You're gonna get a... We'll get you a nice new gun. Oh, this sucks. Oh, I have three sets of weapons now? What the fuck did this happen? Ah, oh, sweet! Okay, what's this? Um... What's Lord's authority? Uh, I don't care. Oh, uh, what's this? Two might? I think Pelagina needs might. Yeah, Pelagina needs more might than dexterity. You can use some dexterity, actually. We have enough heals. Um, DR pierce bonus. DR slash bonus. Edder, Edder, you're getting this. Kana, or... Yeah, Kana, you're getting a new belt. Um, what else do we got? Boots, sneak attack, we don't have a rogue. Um, cloak. Do you need a cloak? You need a good cloak. Here, have a cloak. Um, what about a ring? I don't even know what Lord's Authority is. Um, oh! It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a defensive thing. Um, yeah, let's once per encounter, right? One per stronghold. Um, but is it once per encounter? Oh, shit. That's what happened last time with Kana's shit. Um, once per stronghold turn. I don't know. I don't know. Um, who needs gloves? Anybody need gloves? You need gloves. Yeah. You can- that's actually pretty not bad for you. Who needs a ring? Who needs another ring? Um, five deflection. Um, yeah, sure. You could take this ring. Who else needs another ring? Kana can take this ring. Um, you have a gun. You have a gun. We have to get Durance back in this party. Um, and you have a sword. Did I really- yeah, I really did that, didn't I? Um... Yeah, I, I think I already, uh, let's sell these books, too. We might have to take another trip to Cadnua. And let's put the boots back. Okay, we should be good. Alright, now, what are we doing again? Um, I can go to the rest of the place, and... Hey, Orlon dude. Oh, you leveled up, too. Sweet. Uh, more athletics. All the athletics. Maybe I should give him... Well, he's he's got six survival already, so he's fine. Bonus knockdown! Alright. Awesome. We need you to get a spiffy hat, too. 